16 talented chefs from all over the country are vying to win a $25,000 grand prize in the new culinary competition series called the Globe. One of those amazingly talented chefs is from right here in Utah and joining us today to tell us about his time on the show. Ben, thank you for joining us today. Thank you for having me. Ben, we're so excited to talk to you. Okay, can you tell us how you got to be part of the show or is it kind of, is that a fine line you can't cross? Sure. Uh, no, I, I think it was, a, it was a matter of timing. You know, um, oftentimes chefs are, are trapped in their kitchens, um, but it just kind of worked out. Um, you know, with everything going on over the past year, it, you know, space opened up and, and they reached out to me and, and presented me with this amazing opportunity and so decided to pull the trigger and say why not. Here this we are. is awesome. I want to learn a little bit about your background. Mm -hmm. How long have you been a chef? Where have you worked? Uh, so I've been a chef for about 12, 13 years now um, and I started right here in Salt Lake City. Uh, and I've since then traveled all over the world, um, worked in Copenhagen, Tokyo, uh, Boston, San Francisco, um, wow. so just kind of been all over the place traveling and working in different kitchens. Some incredible places. Okay, tell yeah. us about the show and how is it to compete in it? Yeah, so the show is called The Globe uh, and it's premiering on Discovery Plus and uh, I mean it was just, it was an amazing experience. Um, you know, with all my travels all around the world, uh, I've really fallen in love with culture and you know, using different ingredients that I've never seen before and that's exactly what this show is about. Um, you know, it's, it takes 16 chefs and places us in different countries all around the world uh, and we have to use the ingredients and the techniques from those local uh, areas to wow. create dishes uh, to compete with each other. And, and so it was just, it was an incredible experience, um, you know, as a whole. For you, what was the highlight of being on the show? Uh, you know, I think getting to meet the other chefs, the other competitors. I mean, just everyone was cooking at such a high level. Um, it was really, really fun to meet them and, and see their perspectives and, and, you know, learn a new thing or two. Um, yeah, it was, you know, I made some new friends. It was, it was a really great experience. What's your favorite thing to cook? I have to know. Is it mac and cheese? Is it a quesadilla? I, you know, what do you, you love You can to never cook? go wrong with just plain mac and cheese. That's oh, right. No, but... He's like, <laughs> don't offend me. Uh, no, I, you know, I love cooking foods that remind me of home, that remind me of my childhood growing up. Um, so I cook a lot of Korean food at home. Um, you know, I always have a batch of, of kimchi, you know, stinking up my fridge, uh, and I always <laughs> have a pot of kimchi stew uh, on the stove, just like my mom used to make. Um, so, I mean, that's that's probably my number one go-to, like, comfort food that I eat. Totally. <laughs> so you do cook when you're not just cooking for other people. I feel I, like I would be like, I'm not cooking. Yeah, I, I do, I do. Either that or, you know, just grilled cheese sandwiches. Perfect. You know? <laughs> Mac and cheese, Carrie. Okay, so if we want to watch the show, The Globe, where can yes. we find it? Uh, so it is premiering uh, this Saturday on uh, Saturday, July 17th. Yeah, yes. that's Saturday. Good job. <laughs> uh, on Discovery Plus. Okay. Okay, amazing. Is there anyone who inspires you? Anybody that you like to watch? Any chefs that you just love? Oh, uh, I mean, there's, there's so many. Um, you know, one of my chef mentors that I worked for many years, uh, Chef Michael Mina, was a huge inspiration for me. Um, you know, and, and just there's just so many chefs. Um, it takes a team, right? Yeah, but I mean, I mean, honestly, my, my biggest inspiration was was my mother. You know, growing up in in the kitchens, working mm -hmm. with her, um, not working with her, but like right. <laughs> as a kid, spending time in the kitchen as she, you know, yeah. as she toiled to, to to make, you know, put her love into the food that that we would eat on a daily basis. Has so, really inspired such a great um, example. You know, I know you're. Was, really quick working locally as a private chef and yes. what's the best way to get a hold of you if anyone wants to hire you? Uh, you know social media is probably the easiest way to get a hold of anyone these days mm -hmm. uh, so you know you can find me on Instagram Chef Ben Steigers uh, great. or on Facebook Chef Ben Steigers. Great. Ben, ben great to see you. Thank yeah, you. Thank you very much. Thank you.